This is our Project for Awesome video. We have three things we want to talk to you about. Two of them are just our Project for Awesome because we've got one each and we're doing them in the same video. And the last one is just Bethan wanting to talk to you about forever. Bethan's going to go first with her Raise the Sunshine facts. Raise the Sunshine is a charity which I raise money for myself. And I think it's a great charity. Um, it helps, people, helps children under the age of 18, I think, um, in the UK. Um, that are kind of dying of a fatal disease um, and it helps them to have like a special time or a day like a holiday um, not always a holiday on the website which we'll give links to below um, you can see some examples of days out that kids have had this one girl and she really really wanted to be able to read it all her life and when she was diagnosed with cancer probably was cancer when she was diagnosed with cancer she began to realise that that probably would never happen she, obviously that's quite hard because she was only young and Bethan's charity gave her the chance to live that dream and she got to perform at this huge ballerina stage <laughs> and she, she got to be her ballerina and it just means so much to these kids that are probably not going to live much longer. It's not, it's not a particularly well-known charity so I wanted to make this video to raise awareness for it and also to um, encourage other people to do things for charity like I do and um, to just kind of make it more recognised as this is what Project for Awesome videos do. Ewing sarcoma is a bone tumour, okay. most commonly found in male teenagers. There's a charity called the Ross Foundation founded by Brian O'Reilly. Oh. The Ross Nugent mm -hmm. Foundation supports people that get Ewing sarcoma. Yeah. It's not very common. It's a malignant round cell tumour found most commonly in male teenagers. The Ross Nugent Foundation basically supports people with this charity and was set up by Brian O'Reilly and the Ross Nugent's family. Ewing sarcoma itself was named after John Sarcoma, I believe, after he was the first known person to have got it. He did die from it and more people are dying from it every day. And Brian O'Reilly does little things to do before he dies. Link to him in the description. You should really go watch them. He doesn't get many viewers considering how amazing the work he's doing. I'll also link to the charity's website set up by Brian O'Reilly and you can go do that and visit it. It's a rare disease in which cancer cells are found in bones or soft tissues. I think the Ross Foundation is a very worthy cause because it was just set up by a boy whose friend died of it and he's done so much towards it and I think it's just amazing that he's gone out there and just done it. Okay, so on a lighter note, tomorrow it is Forever Day, yay, Forever Day. If you don't know, if you don't know what that is, um, then it's um, a day set up, a kind of holiday set up by Alex Day to um, celebrate the buying of the song Forever Yours. If you have any ideas of how you're going to celebrate Forever Day, then leave us a comment. Um, also, the original video by Alex will be linked to down there somewhere. Um, and also the Forever Yours music video made by Charlie is so cool like, he's so cool like. Um, Which has over 2 million views. So that's a day which is going to be really cool and um, we'll see you next time. Goodbye.